Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Sarah, and today I would love to review this gorgeous wig for you, which is called Amaretto by Beth Tress in the beautiful color Rose Gold. Now, if you'd like to know how long she is, how the color is composed, what special features she has, how the cap looks from the inside, and how I like her, then stick around and let's get started. So this gorgeous style by Beltres is called Amaretto, and I must say I absolutely love it. Now, I've had the chance to try quite some longer wavy styles from Beltres in the past, and this one is actually the one I think I like most of all the wavy styles I've tried so far. It has the perfect length, touching the shoulders, and the waves are not too tousled and beachy, but a little more defined than with other styles. Now, Originally, this wig didn't belong to me, it belonged to my friend and wig sister, Tina, who sent it to me so I could try it and review it for you. And I already had Caliente in this color, rose gold, but wanted to try the Amaretto too. And after I tried Amaretto, I fell head over heels in love and I was able to convince Tina to sell her to me. <laughs> well, actually, she already was thinking about selling her since she is no longer wearing this color, but I'm really happy I could convince her to sell her to me. So now I have two in this gorgeous color. As you know, Beltrash has several fashion colors. There's the Dusty Rosa, which is a real deep pink, and other great colors like the Sumptuous Strawberry, which I think I've shown you before too. And uh, out of all the fashion colors, this is the one I absolutely love the most. Now, unfortunately, you might have heard, Beltres is discontinuing all the fashion colors this year, and they are coming out with over 20 new colors by the end of the year. So I don't know yet if there will be new fashion colors, hopefully. So if you like the color and want to try it, you better hurry up and order one, <laughs> since I think it won't be available much longer. At least that's what I heard. Now, Beltres doesn't give us a color code for this rose gold, but they describe the color as a beautiful shimmering blend of blondes, pink with a soft light brown root. And I think the description is spot on. It's really a combination of pinks, reds, several blondes, and it has a beautiful root, as you can see, and it definitely also has dimension. And this color application definitely doesn't look like one of those other cheap fashion wigs from Amazon or so that is all one color, but it has quite some dimension and looks like you're a blonde and had your hair colored at the salon for hours and hours until it looked like this. So if you ever wanted to try a fashion color, but not to dye your hair, a wig is the perfect way to do that, of course. And I think this one looks so realistic because of the root and the application of the color. I definitely love wearing this color, especially in the summer, but also from time to time all around the year, whenever I'm in the mood for pink. <laughs> now, Amaretto features a temple to temple lace front and a left side monofilament part, which I'm going to show you from up close, of course, as always. And I think once again, the lace front is really beautifully done. It's really perfect. The density is perfect. Uh, here you can see um, the highlights at the hairline are not just one color. There are a mix of platinum and a rose color. It looks really beautiful and realistic. Now here's the seam of the lace front and the cap. Um, so it's not really extended, but it's also not um, as short as other lace fronts and the seams are beautifully disguised so that's not a problem and also the mono part is beautifully done you can see through to my scalp right out of the box i didn't pluck it or anything it's already perfect when it arrives so in my opinion the special features of this wig are so well done and so realistic now i will show you the length all around the screen so i won't have to bore you with any numbers and we can talk about permities next um, actually, this wig has hardly any permatease at all. Like so many other Beltra styles, I don't feel any at the nape, none at the back, none on the top, just the tiniest amount on the sides, but it's really the bare minimum. And it's also a rather low density style. As you can see on top, she really lays flat and this also looks so realistic. Then she's also really lightweight and really comfortable to wear 
If you don't like permatees and big hair, but still want beautiful waves, I think Amaretto is the perfect style for you. Now, the fibers are, like with all styles from the Cafe collection of Velcrest, made of their heat-defined synthetic, which, in my opinion, are the best heat-defined fibers on the market. And that's not only my opinion, but a lot of my fellow YouTubers agree on that, that Belfrest really has the best, smoothest, silkiest heat-defined fibers. They just feel so soft, it's incredible. Now let me show you this gorgeous style from all sides, and I will show you Caliente in the same color next to this one, so you can compare how the color looks on a little shorter style and this one. Now, isn't it just gorgeous? I mean, both that beautiful color as well as this gorgeous style. <sighs> I totally love it. And now I have two. <laughs> and you might have noticed, although I shook her and I looked down, Amaretto stays out of my face beautifully. And although it has quite some length and it's not layered, it still isn't a face flopper, which is amazing. And I really love it. I've had so many other similar wavy styles that are total face floppers, and I really hate it. But this one hasn't been styled, as far as I know. I'm pretty sure the lift here was already baked in. I did have to alter the Caliente. I gave her some lift and height here in front because she was really flat. I like her much better now, but the Amaretto looks like this straight out of the box. Now, when it comes to styling, of course, there are some things you can do with a style with that length. You could even do an updo or a half updo, for example, or wear her with a headband and so on, or just wear her just the way she comes, like I do. I think she's just perfect the way she is. Now, let's try her with glasses, as always. And it's even a color match. <laughs> and that's no problem at all, of course, with hardly any permatease. There's enough room between the ears and the ear tabs to fit glasses. All right, now let's have a look at that gorgeous color outside in natural daylight, of course, on both styles, Amaretto and Caliente. this just a beautiful color how do you like it do you have it or are you maybe considering it would you wear a color like this for fun please let me know in the comments below i'd really love to know okay now last but not least let's have a look at the cap of amaretto from the inside so here's the cap from the inside here you can see that beautiful lace front with the highlights right at the hairline that is not extended but the seams are hidden quite well then that lace front seamlessly goes into that monofilament part, which is quite deep and also quite wide, so you have enough parting space. Then she has the felt-covered ear tabs with the metal stays inside. The rest of the cap is open-wefted. She has an extended nape and the typical belt dress pull strap adjusters. All in all, this is a very well-made cap. Okay, that was my review of Amaretto and a little comparison to Caliente. I hope you liked it and it's helpful. If you haven't done so yet, please subscribe to my channel so you won't miss my future videos. And there's a new one coming out each Friday at least. If you have any questions, please put them in the comments below and I will gladly reply. Now, thank you all so much for being here. I really appreciate it. I hope you're well. Stay that way and I will see you again soon. Take care. Bye-bye. But they describe, but they describe the color as, let me check, here we go. Color, especially so, in the summer, but also from time to time in the winter. So I won't have but to also, bore you with any numbers. But still, right. but still want, but still want some vault, but still want. <sighs> I totally love, I totally love it. <laughs> 
I totally love it. <sighs> now, if you like these styles and would like to see more of Beltress, why not check out this video? Or also this video? Or both? Ha <laughs> ha